Hello equestrians and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to another big horse show. We are off to Hickstead for the Royal International Horse Show. Um, this is mostly a showing show but there might be some jumping on today. I think there is, I'm pretty sure there is. Um, but Pips is all suited and booted in her Derby House rug and fly mask ready for a day out in the field and someone is very kindly finishing off for us later tonight. You excited? Hey! Yay! Yay. <laughs> this is a really good show. Hickstead is like one of my favourite venues ever, ever, ever. And it's like on my bucket list to ride around there, hopefully with Pips. It's my first uh, trip to Hickstead. Oh, it's going to be amazing. Absolutely I'm amazing. And we're going to be joined by Lee Dutch CJ, if you're not already subscribed to her. And Brooke's here and Hazel is also coming, so Brooke is Nick's daughter for anyone who doesn't realise. Um, so yeah, it's going to be a nice little girls day out. Hey Pips! Might even go to Brighton afterwards if, if we feel up to it, because yeah. it's not that far from Brighton. And it'd be nice to go watch the sunset from the, uh, from the sea. Well, we will see, see, see. Yes, anyway, we've got a lot to do. Nice kisses, thank you. Oh, look at, uh, anyway, we need to get going, so let's get into it. Have a nice day in the field, girls. And we'll see you tomorrow. Yeah! Bye! Sweet pop me yard is your ho! Yo ho yo ho! An equestrian life for me! <laughs> ah. Oh no! <laughs> oh, not, so this is why I should just concentrate on what I'm doing and not mucking about. <laughs> it's a muck out instead of mucking out. Uh, mucking about. I've actually done the mucking out, it's fine. <laughs> Are you recorded already? Yeah, I am. <laughs> Why not? Uh, hi. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> We're on our way to Hickstead. Woo! -woo. <laughs> Royal International. Here we come. They won't know what's here. No, they really won't. Oh, we Lee's thought it now. was bad at Windsor with just me and Nick. Now we've got two kids and Lee. No, we've got three kids with us, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> no, we've got five kids, let's face it. <laughs> three big kids and two little kids. It's gonna be good. <laughs> Not accompanied by any adults. <laughs> Not accompanied by any adults. <laughs> oh dear. That's gonna be funny. I like this. I quite like how it, I thought we were going to be upside down when I flipped the flipping screen. I was like, that's going to be awkward. Yeah, that's going to be hard to film. I'm 
We're here. We're here. Just admiring some beautiful ponies. Say hi, guys. <laughs> hey, Hazy. You're right down there. Okay, so I'm just at the Botanica stall. Um, make sure you go and follow them on Instagram. We've been having a good look at their range of products here. So what have we got? We've got the face cream, fly spray, mane and tail spray. We've got all sorts here. Yeah, eternal youth. I think I might need some of that. Tur turned 30 this year. Mane and tail. Mane and tail. This the tank does show, does the show shade does a lot, but it's not slippery, it's not dangerous. Okay. And uh, this, those two complete the thing. And, um, Mechanic, yeah, we've just been trying that, it's really nice. Conjunction with the cleansing wash, the two together, and these are the conditions that it, 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 uh, it's really good with, you know, anything with the skin. Yeah, so we've got a, a huge list here of all the things that it is good for. Wow, look at this. We have Nick and Laura, gold medal, Beijing, London, Rio. We have Zara, ex world champion, Sophie the Countess of Essex, Super Vet, <laughs> Natasha Baker, five gold medal, Scott Brash, gold medalist, world's number one, Sue Smith, who won the Grand National, the Queen Stud Fair Manager in Balmoral, John Whittaker, and uh, William Fox Pitt. William Fox Pitt, and this is our packaging in China, number one. Oh, wow. We're the only Westerners selling herbal medicine to China. Oh, my goodness. And we sell by the top. <laughs> and I said I was crazy. <laughs> Well, thank you very much for taking us around the stall and showing us your products today. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Photo bombed. <Yeah. laughs> really? What are you doing? Hiya! <laughs> Wearing your Botanica hat that was very kindly of gifted. We've all got one. Are you watching? Where's the horses? You stood on the cooler box. Ah, <laughs> oh, is that
I was just pointing out this massive water jump over here. Me and Nick are like, no chance, no way. Lee's like, hell yeah, <laughs> I'll give that a go. Oh, that is really zoomed in on your face. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Uh, Peps used to have it's now a very faded pink but oh my goodness you would definitely spot them in the in the field wouldn't you with that color so a little less in your face they look very much the same on camera but oh no there you can see the difference We are just at the main arena at the moment watching some jump in. Is there a horsey coming? Not quite yet, but I wanted to show you guys the Derby Bank. Look how steep that is. It's almost a 90 degree angle, look. And on Derby Day, they've got to come across the top, jump a fence, stop and come down the bank, and then jump another fence at the bottom. Scary stuff. <laughs> that was a Devaku, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. Uh huh. The people who watch TikTok too much. I'm sure the show jumpers are very much appreciative of us. Shut me asleep! Yay! Oh my god, this child. I need to zoom right out. She's been fighting sleep for what, the last half an hour? Finally gone. I'm sure she'll appreciate being on YouTube one day, fast asleep in her pram. Brooke's taking photos. I'm taking photos. <laughs> Please take your photos. <laughs> Spot the Instagram. Oh, you take a picture no, as well. I'm oh, just, uh, just watching, yeah. observing. Nice little grey going past. Well, I said little. That's actually quite a decent sized pony over there. Oh, well, that grey was definitely more of a dressage horse because they just had two refusals and an elimination. So that's our our verdict. Wrong discipline because <laughs> it's a very very nice flashy horse, isn't it? Yeah. We like that grey. Yeah. So Although. Sorry. <laughs> to be fair, we're saying that about every horse that comes out. It's like, oh, I like that one. Oh, look at that one. Oh, they're pretty ponies. <laughs> we literally feel like kids in a candy shop. Letting go, yeah, it isn't easy. Too hard, slowly breaking. Living the highs and lows, I'm keeping busy. Don't know if we're worth saving. Are we meant to be or are we second guessing? We 
He's like, oh yeah, that's tasty. Is that nice? Look at these dapples, guys. <sighs> he looks so dapper. Oh, that's okay. <laughs> Hello. Hi. Do you want to give yourself a cheeky shout out? Hello yeah. to yeah. horsing around. Yeah. Bojack and Bodie horsing around. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, he's been such a good boy today. My superstar. Aren't <laughs> you? You're my superstar. Look at this, the ultimate matchy matchy look. <laughs> the green machine. We're just at Brook Farm Training Centre watching some of the dressage going on. I'm with Nick and Brooke and Lucy. <laughs> Getting all teary at the pony. <laughs> a very cute pony that just rode round. We've got another cute pony coming down now. With a 10 year old that rides better than me. Yeah, the <laughs> they, I think most people here can ride better than I can, to be fair. <laughs> Oh, what a cute little pony. So cute. And this Frisian. Oh, very nice. There's another cute pony. Where is it? <gasps> He's hiding from me. Oh, he's all the way over there. Hello, hello. So I know it has been a hot minute. <laughs> Hopefully you can hear me okay because I went to a show which I vlogged. So that vlog is coming. Um, and it got my camera got rained on basically. Doing it. <laughs> and I know that the camera microphone isn't doing very well it's not very healthy but I've got an additional microphone so fingers crossed you'll be able to hear me okay if not I do apologize for the audio quality um, I also apologize that there hasn't been a video for the last month um, I have filmed like I had four videos ready and ready to edit um, but I've really struggled for time and I've also not been 100% I did open up about that on my Instagram story so I just had to take a step back relieve the pressure a little bit just kind of focus on myself a bit and I do feel much better for that so thanks for being patient and I do hope that you enjoyed the video uh, that was long awaited this Hickstead video we had a great time at Hickstead always love going there it's one of my favorite venues and somewhere that I really want to ride around one day we did go to Brighton but we were a little bit disappointed um, when we got there there was some kind of festival going on or something and it was really busy and there was actually like nowhere for food the plan was to go there, have a little bit of a play on the beach, and then go and get some food from somewhere. Um, the only place we found was like a pizzeria place, and Hazel can't have normal pizza because she can't have dairy, so we ended up just getting McDonald's on the way home <laughs> from one of the service stations. So that was a little bit of a, kind of a wasted trip, but at least like we've been there, seen it now, so unless we kind of went to the wrong bit of beach, I don't know. 
um because i don't really know brighton very well so yeah i have a show vlog coming from my first ever combine training i also have a sponsored ride video that i need to finish and upload um so there are a couple of videos in the works and they should be coming out like quite rapidly now and then i'll get filming like more relevant stuff so Yes, once again, apologise for the lack of videos. Hopefully this kind of makes up for it and you enjoyed it. I got to like release my inner this is me by <laughs> filming some like pretty cool shots, bringing my big camera out again with me. I haven't like played with my big camera for a long time, so that was nice. Um, kind of got the bug back, you know, for doing some photography and videography work. However, my big lens has broken, but that's another. <laughs> I've got a lot of camera issues that need to be sorted. Um, so that's another kind of reason for the vlogs falling short is my vlogging camera microphone. This is the first time I'm filming again with it since it got rained on so I'm not sure what the quality is going to be like but yeah I know the microphone will probably need to be fixed. My big camera lens needs to be fixed so got that sort of stuff to work on but anyway thank you all for watching. I hope you did enjoy. If you did please like and subscribe because it really does help me out and I really appreciate it. And until the next one, guys, I'll see you later. Bye.